This has been an awful experience. I regret my choices. I felt like we were gonna tip backwards. It was that steep. I'm so scared I'm gonna crash it. I'm a sweaty mess after all of this, <laughs> honestly. Ooh. And this place is stunning. Look what we've got. Mountainous islands out in the sea. Da -da 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 -da. Da -da 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 -da. Good morning. Oh, this is fun. From our very cold and noisy park up. <laughs> I'm really cold this morning. But we are doing something kind of exciting today, although it kind of feels like it's going to be a bit of a flop as well. I am trying to get a new camera because this one is really annoying me with the splodge in the middle. It's so frustrating. I know it happened ages ago. And since I've been filming this entire trip, it's been there. And it comes and it goes, but it's just really, really annoying. We're also looking at getting something else, which I'm very excited about. But I don't want to get too excited because I don't know if we're going to get it. But we are looking at also getting a drone. So watch this space. Hopefully, some point soon, hopefully, I don't know, we'll have something. <laughs> something of improvement. I need the big guns out today. Oh, this thing flopping about. I'm taking it down. <laughs> this jacket is like the best thing we've bought for this trip. When it's not raining, I mean, it does look like it's gonna rain. And we are forecast rain for the foreseeable at the moment. Also, this quencher, I think it is. We got it from France. It was only 10 euros and it's been amazing. <laughs> kind of wish I'd bought two. <laughs> Warmed up to the max. Sitting in the basement apartment I rented with currently driving through tiny little roads. <laughs> Very really steep, horrible. tiny little roads. We're going to first for one a minute ago. They are up really, the really steep. And the reason why we've done it is because we've gone into a, ta a city and I was like, oh, avoid tolls. Added like 10 minutes, but I didn't think it was going to be 10 minutes of this. this I thought it was going to be 10 this minutes outrageous. just because it was a bit more back roads getting here. But this has been ridiculous. People that live here must be looking at us drive past thinking, what are these people doing? It's awful. This has been an <laughs> awful experience. I regret my choices. One of the shops we came here for is permanently <laughs> bloody closed as well. The whole reason we came to this town and not the one that was on our route was because there were two it shops. Had this shop as well as the other shop. This is why we don't go to cities. Point, point blank, this is why we don't go to cities. Oh, I hate it. I've never known such crazy weird roads. I think we're getting onto a normal road again now. I kind of wish I'd filmed before, but yeah. I was also kind of panicking. <laughs> I mean, we got halfway up a hill and I had to go into first gear because we were so, it was so steep. So steep. I felt like we were going to tip backwards. It was, was that steep. It, giving it our all in second. As we were going up there, I was like clenching everything like, ah. Oh! Oh, it was not fun. Not a fun experience. Not a fun doing? time. Ah! I don't like cities! <laughs> Get us back to the country. We're bumping. Too many people, too many big vehicles, too much going on. It's just ridiculous. I think I would have rather paid whatever the toll was. I think when we come out of this place, because we just got to go straight back out, <laughs> I think we're going to go the toll way. <laughs> we love we learn, I guess. Oh. Here's the drone we're looking at. I'm really hoping that they have it in stock. It would be very cool to walk away with the drone. Don't know about a camera though. We've just come out into the shop next door, which I think is like a discounty shop. But we couldn't get the drone in there, but we have found a shop that's kind of on the way. I mean, it's quite cool. It's down in some islands, so we're gonna go there. And they've got it in stock, so we may end up with the drone soon. But I don't know about a new camera yet. I don't know what we're going to do about that or where we're going to get it from. But we are now on a shopping hunt. But I don't know what this shop is. I thought it was all just food shops, but now I'm thinking it's not. Hopefully we'll find what we need. 
Well, that was a flop. That food shop was not a food shop. It was like a B&M home stores or something like that. Like a couple of bits of food, but loads of homeware and stuff in there. So we just walked around the entire shop, picked up a couple of things at the beginning, which were food, and then just decided to leave because the queue was huge. There was only one till and we need to get on. For reference of what we did earlier, this is the faster route with tolls and look at the greyed out or the slightly less bold, here we go. This one, look what we did instead. And they were all up and round, random little roads and tight bends and they were so steep, it was awful. We've bought a drone. We now need to go and pick it up. So the, we've paid for it here and we can go and pick it up in the other store. Are you excited? I'm very excited, I can't wait to get up. I'm so yeah. scared I'm gonna crash it. Now we've actually made it into a food shop. It's like a Rima 1000, I think it's called. And I just found some gluten-free tortelloni, but it's frozen. I'm looking for peas, but we found a shop. I'm a sweaty mess after all of this, <laughs> honestly. I'm stressed. That's one way we're to start the video. <laughs> I'm just, we've just been running around the food shop. We're trying to get going, but we're hungry. We haven't eaten. <laughs> Well, we got to go through a toll and I don't like doing tolls when we're in different countries because I've got to lean over the dog and get out the cart while clean out the window and everything to do it. I also just bought some more of those oat bread things, the gluten-free oat bread things. I might just have one of those as a little snack. Great idea for your bread. What? What about your strawberry yogurt with fresh blueberries on top? Ooh, just bought some bloobs. It's a one of my favourite ones. Julian yogurt. Um, and I just bought some strawberry yogurts because I don't know if I even vlogged this, but the yogurts that Rich bought before, he was like, "Oh, I bought you some blueberry <laughs> yogurts," and I was like, "Oh, that sounds nice." And I had one the night of the Northern Lights. Actually, that night, I was like, "Oh yeah, I'll have one tonight." Um, no, they weren't blueberry, were they? They were blooming prune yogurts. <laughs> <And> I, <laughs> horrible. They were horrid. They tasted like <laughs> sour cream almost. Like it was just horrible. <laughs> now I don't want to speak too soon, but it seems like we've just gone through that whole road and no toll is there anyway. <laughs> so we just did that crazy journey to Possibly. get there. It seems that way. Potentially definitely. without any reason. It feels like we're out of the I feel now, like so we're yeah. out of it. That's and hilarious. this is the road that we came in on, I'm pretty sure. It was sure. an adventure. <sighs> Horrifying adventure, but it was an Maybe adventure. Maybe we'll get billed at some point. Maybe I should check, actually. Maybe I should Google, find out what tolls there are, and if we need to like, pay yeah, online or something. We've seen this a lot in Norway, actually. This place is incredible. Also, we realised as we were driving this way that we're actually going to the Lofton Islands. Um, we didn't even realise that's where the shop was. So I'm very excited that we've ended up doing this because we may have ended up missing it um, if, we if we'd driven past. So yeah, we're on our way. Rich is just making some food while I'm taking Pops for a walk. And this place is stunning. Absolutely stunning. I bought some of these from the shop. It's really hard to find gluten-free breakfast bars out here. And everything is so, so expensive in the shops. But I have found these. I have found, seen these before actually, and I've never tried them and I've always wanted to. No added sugar, no palm oil, no gluten, just joy. This is the peanuts and fudge one. So I thought, why not give it a go? Mm. There's like whole peanuts in here. It tastes like a Snickers. The other ones that I've got are soft toffee and crunchy caramel. Um, also, these are the other ones that I found. Cranberry and blueberry nut bars from the co-op. These ones are also gluten-free, so I've had these a couple of times. Look what we've got. The DJI Mini 4 Pro. I'm so excited. Yeah. We went for the Very full, excited. full shebang with the carry case and all the extras. I didn't expect it to come all in the case. I'm surprised it will fit in there actually. Ready to go. So we've got the body of the drone, the controller. That looks quite good size as well for the screen. That's good. And then some extra batteries and a battery charging block thing. Oh, isn't that satisfying as well? 
Hopefully the one in there already has got some charge in it. We can send it straight up when we get there. We need to register it and stuff first though. Ah! How exciting! I'm so excited to get some content with it. Watch this space. We're now about to pop back into the shop because I've seen that the dash cams aren't actually that expensive. And here she is. What have we got? She's got a dash cam too! Get ready for some cool views. We made it! We've made it to our spot after a mammoth drive. We've just made it down to the beach. Poppy's loving it on the rocks. Beth's all wrapped up cozy and warm because the wind's coming in. But the sun's setting nicely. views here are incredible. The drive here was really nice as well. But since we hit the Lofton Islands, it's, oh, it's just been incredible. Loads of just mountainous islands out in the sea and yeah, really nice. Anyway, we're getting rained on now. Hey, just cooking dinner. We have just a basic tomato, vegetable, pasta. Pretty simple dinner tonight. And of course, as always, gluten free been starving today we've hardly eaten anything um we've just been driving and driving and driving today annoyingly still not found the new camera um still on the lookout for a new vlog camera so as you can see there's still a blurry spot on this one but hopefully we'll get that soon and then we'll be sorted yeah and hopefully i'll have all of this sorted soon too yeah now you can I've see us the fly test. the drone up so now I'm trying to add my flyer ID and my something else ID. There's two different IDs and one of the IDs isn't working. It's telling me that it's wrong. So I, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> and I've been meanwhile setting up our dash cam. So that's ready to go now. Um, so yeah, really excited for all of this. It's cook time. <laughs> I what's going on then. <laughs> We're going to try the gluten free cookies, toffee and chocolate chip. Dummel. Dummel. Hey, dumb and dummel. Pops. Hello. Oh. Cookie biscuit time for Pops too. I'm unsure. Instant reaction. Yeah, what a weird flavour. No, it's a bit of a funky taste, isn't it? It tastes how it smells in a pet shop. Right, pet shop cookies. These are a no for me. Oh, I don't really like them either. I mean, they're not the worst things in the world, but... Um, and they're really, I don't really recommend. Really solid as well, isn't they? I don't know if it's just because it's cold here. I wouldn't buy again. No, they're just hard and crispy. Dummels, get a big no from us. Uh-uh. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.